Hello, my name is Graham. I'm here to show you how to use the atomic absorption spectrometer that you'll be using in CHEM 2302 and CHEM 2303. So when you come to the uh, lab, the first thing that you're going to do is make a series of solutions. Once you have all your solutions made and filled the sample vials with each solution that you're going to be using, you're going to take the sample vials and you're going to load them into the auto sampler of the spectrometer, uh, putting them in the correct position that's given in your lab manual or by your TA or the lab coordinator. Once you have all the samples loaded properly in the proper place, you can put the lid back on the auto sampler, make sure it locks into place properly, and then you're going to come to the computer and begin your analysis with the computer. And so the first thing that you're going to want to do on the computer is you're going to want to open a data set file. So you're going to click on open beside the data set results name. Then you're going to type in something here that identifies you and what you're analyzing. So you can put in your name and your sample number. And then you click OK. And then you're going to come down to the analyze tab, click on the rebuild list, and then you're going to click on analyze all. That's going to start the run. The instrument's going to take approximately 30 to 40 minutes, maybe even an hour to run the samples. So once it's done, get a TA or the lab coordinator to check your results and get them printed for you.